everybody. Uh, PJ here, just off the Greenland Road again, and we're going to have a quick look around a couple of industrial sites while we're out here. So let's crack on and get on with it, shall we? So we've got a company here called Norton Cat Product. Looks a bit warm in there, is it? 
Yeah, well, the guy with a check shirt on up there says, be careful filming. Pardon? He says, what are you filming for? It says, YouTube. Oh, he right. says, oh, be careful filming. So, oh, whether that was some... Some guy in a check shirt up there, so whether that was some kind of veiled threat or not, I don't know. Dinosaurs, aren't they foundries? The what, sorry? Dinosaurs. Dinosaurs? How many foundries in Sheffield now? I have no idea, mate. Look, it's five. Yeah? Yeah, well, oh. where did I see another one? Um, <laughs> There's four. Holbrook. So one on Holbrook. No, sorry, at Dinnington. Oh, yeah, the furniture and white. They make uh, casings for whites. pumps. Furnish some whites. Yeah. 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 There's not many about. I must admit. I'll tell you what. There is a lot of recycling plants. Oh, uh, that's a huge thing at Fuel Church. Yeah. 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 Yeah, for you too. It's all beyond me, I have a dinosaur with that. Ah, well. Do you watch YouTube at all? No, but I don't know. I minimise me, I've got one of these iPhone things, but... I'm a, I'm a dinosaur, and I can't be asked. Well, I'm older than you, and I'm not a dinosaur. Hello, <laughs> hello, me. Ah. What are you going in there? You are, sorry? What are you coming in there? Uh, on 12th of next month, I get my pension. Yeah, only no teenager two years. Yeah, a couple of years. It's still older now. My pension is 66, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Uh, it was 67, but I'm in birthday in four. Uh, it was 65, and then the bastards yeah. put it up to 66. That would be like to end it all that, honestly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've retired now, so... What did you do? Um, I went to army for a long time, and then when I come out of army, um, I, I did a bit of factory work, only a couple of months, yeah. hated it. Went yeah, and then um, I started teaching people to drive. My dad did what? Teaching people to, yeah, to yeah. drive. My dad was a driving instructor. Well, that helped. And he got me into it, and then I started teaching motorbikes, and I moved on to lorries and buses. And then I went on to doing all plant cranes and heavy lifters. Well, some, and that's good timing, isn't it? I have training, yeah, yeah. I mean, we all different aspects you've done, all different jobs you've done. So. Well, I mean, apart from army and doing training, that's about all I've done. Others yeah, do. Yeah, all that with cars and motorbikes and lorries and buses. And yeah, all. but we're all part of the same thing, you know what I mean? What were, what were you in army? I'm an engineer. Engineer? Yeah, I went in as a, as a boy at 15. Uh, junior leaders regiment took over at 15 year old. And then as soon as I was 18, I went to Airborne, I used to jump out of airplanes for a living. Your dad had me and him out for Ormond. You what, sorry? Your dad had me and him out for Ormond. Yeah. He'd been in Royal Scots in the Second World War. And, he, and then I ended up, I got a job at Fit, and he didn't want me out at Fit. No. So he got me a job in a foundry. Well, all I wanted was a motorbike. Well, wanted. you know, you know, when we were at school, um, Education then was basically uh, the educated you to either work in a factory, round here anyway, work in a factory, yeah, yeah. good output, or good forces. And that's all they educated yeah. you for. They didn't educate you to go to university and all the rest of it like kids nowadays. You know. It's a different, it's a different, it's a different work you've Yeah, yeah, of course it is. It's a different world not, altogether. Not so much work now, is it? Like Sunday dinners and that. You don't eat meat and stuff because they don't work like they do. Yeah, yeah. You know what I, mean? I mean, no, it's a Sunday dinner vegetarian. nowadays. Oh no, I'm not a vegetarian. No, I'm don't, just saying, don't let dreadlocks kill you. I'm not kidding you. I'm no, not I'm a vegetarian. Saying, like, okay. That's why they fed them like they did because that, that's tradition, weren't it? Yeah. No, it's and heavy work like as well, you needed yeah. that scram, didn't you? Well, yeah. hey, up, mate. I don't know about that. Uh, what are you filming, the old? Uh, anything of interest. I'm talking to this young man at the minute and filming him and he's filming me and about working in a foundry and stuff like that. I'm interested. It's interesting. No, no, I've not, I've not spilled any beans. No, I mean, what you mean filming on factory? Just through gate, that's all. No. 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 Can you delete it? No, I can't, mate, no. Right. It'll go to solicitors. Oh, it's fine. It's, it's evading GDPR. So it's this. No, 
I'm not inside. If the door's open, I can. You cannot film inside a factory without permission. Yeah, I can. can From not. a public place, I can. You cannot. Sorry, you can. One door closes, another one still open. There you go. Both things come round here now. Close this door. Possibly don't realise this door's open. That's what they are, I'm just saying that's what they look like. 
there's a lot of duction there that uh, fetches piping out the out the foundry so I would suggest that that's what they are if anybody knows any different please let me know it'll be appreciated just pop it in the comments anyway that's the foundry done um, first guy was absolutely brilliant the second guy was a total cop like I'm giving secrets away and uh, and all the rest of it. I don't know why you thought I would do it. But anyway, if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, please share, please subscribe, and have a cocky git, and I'll see you later. Bye everybody.